Okay. Hello everybody. Dave here from Tameside Paranormal Researchers. Um, I'm out in the country park where the alleged activity has been reported. The uh, spirit of a young girl. Um, so just thought I'd have a little bit of a look, a bit of a scouting mission. See if I can pick up on anything and do a, a quick spirit box session. So nothing over the top today, nothing too long. This is just going to be a short one. Um, see if we can't see if we can't pick up on something. She's a, it's always worth a go. And uh, that was a deer. Actually, that was quite close. <laughs> That was a deer, so of course you get a roe deer have been introduced locally and uh, they startle very easily. So with them crashing through the undergrowth, people that may be not aware that it's a uh, deer being startled and crashing through the bracken or the undergrowth might be easily alarmed by the sound. So it went off in there, that kind of direction over there behind the trees, over there. So, uh, certainly didn't hang around anyway. Okay, we'll do a bit of a we'll do a bit of a spirit box session. Find somewhere to do a session, I think. So we're uh, back shortly. Okay. If there is anybody with us from the world of spirit, can you make the lights flash on this meter, please? It won't harm you in any way. The lights will flicker and it will just let me know that you might be with me. Can you do that, please? There's the spirit of a young lady with me at the moment. Can you please make the lights flash? Please try to approach this grey box, it will make the lights flash. Can you do that, please? Okay, just before starting this section of recording, I had actually walked up and down this particular area and uh, took a few readings and I rather done a sweep with the K2 and uh, nothing untoward. Obviously as you can imagine in the middle of a country park area with no power lines in close proximity the baseline reading was zero which is obviously what we want there or thereabouts so zero so no fluctuations uh, none experienced at the moment but I'm supposed to uh, I rather said to walk this path so we, we'll keep trying give a shout on the spirit box in a moment see what happens okay if there's anybody with us from the world of spirit can you please say hello or give us some kind of a sign that you're here say your name Please give me a definite sign that you're here. Can you say hello? Or can you make the lights flash on the meter there? Is the spirit of a young girl with us, please? Do we have the spirit energy of a young lady with us? If you talk into this box that I have in my hand, I'll be able to hear you and we'll be able to make some kind of contact. Can you do that, please? Can you tell me how old you are, my love, please?
so no readings at the minute. No activity, everything's fairly flat. Try and shout anyway, see what happens. Can you please make that box light up? Or can you please say your name into the box in my hand, please? Can you please tell me how you passed over? Please tell me what year it is now. Do you know what year it is? That sounded a little freaky. <laughs> okay, can you please tell me what year it is? Can you tell me how you died? Tell me the name of this place, please. Can you please tell me the name of this place? the young lady trying to communicate. Can you try to make the lights on that box light up? Please say the number four. Can you please say the number four? Can you say my name? Some nice bird song at this time of of day. Coming towards dusk now, early evening. But, uh, no readings or hits on the K2, which is as I suspected really, unless it's done it while I haven't been watching, which uh, could be the case, but I doubt it. So, We'll uh, call it, call it quits. Like I said, just a short one. A little bit of a scouting mission. You get lots of uh, urban legend and stories and tales in a small community, so it may be down to that. Can't say 100% because you haven't spent enough time looking into it. Of course, with it being right on the back doorstep, it can sometimes be overlooked and it's not a go-to place for me or any of the other members of the team really so I tend to go 
further afield to other places. But uh, I might check it out again at some stage. It got me out for a little while. Uh, and I'll probably condense all this footage down to about... I don't know. There's not a lot to report really, so... I'll do it. To make it worth uploading, I suppose I'll cut it down to about 10 minutes. Uh, maybe less than that, but we'll see. But, uh, I'll be back with some other team members and uh, we'll go somewhere else really soon. Thanks a lot. Ciao for now.